Gonna be installing the uh, water pump on here before timing these gears because the water pump has a little needle on the bottom of it, which is used on your uh, crank pulley here indicator. All right, so you got your Chinese pump, you got your back all buttered up and uh, using this Chinese gasket as well. Cause it doesn't seal right around here, so it might be fucked. So I made a little modification to my tool here. Still ghetto as hell. I was having some gas problems with my welder. So all I did was pinch this in and add a little brace here. So let's see how that works. Works well enough. This thing was like 17 bucks maybe, 15 something. There you have it, rocker removal on an M117. And just go ahead and repeat for the other side and we'll get the timing set. I'm gonna be installing new guides in here. This one's just a little bit dirty. They are brand new. And uh, to get these guys in, the only short one, they all face, by the way, let me back up. All the guides look like so. And basically they face uh, know, something like this, I think. All the short ends face upwards. So I made little marks on it for myself. And uh, this one goes on the left hand head outboard side, and these go here and here, same part number. We're gonna be reusing the pins and you wanna put a uh, sealant in here so that that green goo that I used before should be really nice for that. And uh, they're a little hard to sneak in here with the cam gear on, so you pretty much have to pop the chain and, and get it on here. Uh, a little bit of a game. We have our two pins here, and first I'm going to sneak that guide in. Basically, just easier to pop this gear off. Position that there for a second. And you pretty much lined up.
I'm gonna put the master link on here. Link and the little clips. <laughs> I don't like these ones with the little, little, little clips like this. It's better when they have a larger master link. This is a supposedly a genuine Ewe's timing chain. This is the timing chain kit I used. Silly, you should be using a one piece here. Lined up on the cam here still. You have all the links in here. One, two, and then we're gonna put the last one on here. Look at this. This is what's holding the whole goddamn engine together. This little thing. This little thing is the whole thing holding this from flying off the rails. Oh my god, I'm gonna I'm gonna drop this in here. I'm gonna drop it. I'm gonna fucking drop it in here. Still definitely off there a little bit. I'm gonna have to back it off. Tooth? That's a lot of teeth to back off. Using a Febby tensioner here, part number 02135. Some little instructions comes up wrapped nicely in a separate bag oiled nice gasket looking here Coming up to TDC. Perfect, I think. Spun the engine over twice on the crank. Back to TDC. Alignment marks are where they should be. Missing link is in the same position as started. And right hand camshaft is also lined up here.